Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Edmond Mindaros and for today's a quick tutorial and I'm going to show you guys on how to resolve Windows update with the error code KB5058379 failed to install in Windows 10 a computer. So KB5058379 is an essential cumulative security update released on May 13, 2025 for Windows 10 versions 22H2. It is a part of Microsoft regular patch, includes major security fixes and performance improvements. This update is categorized as critical and is necessary for all supported systems to provide stability and protections against threats. And several reasons for this error include damage or missing system files, insufficient days space and third-party antivirus programs then i'll show you possible solutions to resolve this issue so all you have to do is to pre up system drive space so all you have to do on start menu and then here for search for apps and then you need to type desk cleanup and then you need to click open and then if your Windows is installed on Drive C, then pick it from the list. It should be by default. So pop up this desk cleanup drive selections. And then we need to select this C drive. And then click OK. And then we will wait for calculating and scanning. And then pop up this desk cleanup for C drive. And then next step, you can see this cleanup system files. And then click again. And then again here, drive selections, and then we need to select C drive, and then click OK. And we will wait for calculating and scanning for a desk cleanup. And the last settings is for desk cleanup for a C drive. So here, select largest portions of data use. This typically include temporary internet files, Windows update, temporary files, Recycle bin and delivery optimizations files. So we need to select one by one. So temporary internet files. And then we need to check this box. And then delivery optimization files. And again, select this box. And then recycle bin. Select this box as well with temporary files. And then the Windows upgrade lag files. And then you need to select this box. Okay, so once you select those largest portion of data use and the next step you can see this okay and then click and are you sure you want to permanently delete these files and then click delete these files and we will wait again to complete for cleaning up for c drive in our windows system all right so once it's complete and then you need to restart so click on the start menu and then click this restart to fix this issue and if the error still persists and the next solutions that we're going to do is to run the windows update troubleshooters so all you have to do is to click again on start menu and then here for search for apps and then you need to type this troubleshoot settings and then click open and then here are troubleshoots under at options and then you need to select other troubleshooters and then click and again here at other troubleshooters and under at most frequent then you need to select windows update and on right side you can say this run and then click and pop up this windows update detecting problems so we will wait to complete the initializing and diagnostic process okay so troubleshooting has completed so this is the result that problem spawn windows update issues this is the one issues and the other one service registrations missings are corrupt so already fixed and the other one if this issue is already fixed then click yes but if not then click no and then you need to follow the screen instructions to fix these issues all right so once you're done here at windows update troubleshooters and then we need to close and then here at start menu and then we need to restart this pc again to fix these issues Alright, so that's it guys. So thanks for watching and hopefully this video was helpful to resolve Windows update error on your PC. And give it a thumbs up and share it with others who are having problems with Windows.
And if you're new to our channel, I invite you to subscribe and click the bell to not miss out on the latest for Windows tutorials. Thank you guys and see you in my next tutorial.